Good afternoon, everyone. Hello. Welcome to the AI Entrepreneur Experience. In, in this session, we will be talking about the success and failure of, of an entrepreneur. The, the name of the session is Methodology of Creation. For, for today's uh, session, we come with the presence of Javier Carvalho, who is an experienced entrepreneur who has launched uh, multiple startups in, 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 in national and international business. Hey, Javier, how are you? Thanks for, thanks for joining nice us. Nice to meet you. Same. Thank you. And uh, I, would, I would like to start uh, the interview with, um, with, uh, with a topic that has been very discussed in, in, in a long time. And it's about entrepreneurs. Are they, are they born? Um, are they born or are they made? What would you uh, say about this topic? Okay. Well, my, in my experience, mm -hmm. okay, I think entrepreneur usually is uh, more made than uh, than born. Obviously, there you you can find a lot of people who are born entrepreneurs since mm -hmm. the, they are very young. They like very much to to make deals in in their class or uh, in yeah, their from street a young age, with yeah. other people, and that you find many people like that. But uh, most uh, my in, I think that most of the people became entrepreneur mm -hmm. almost by accident. When I you see. talk to many of them, they say that they they never thought of being to be an entrepreneur mm -hmm. because it was very scary or because uh, they didn't have they they didn't have the money at the time or whatever. But circumstances changed it and uh, they needed to. To work for themselves, yeah. So uh, they decided to, even without realize, uh, realizing that they were, they were becoming entrepreneurs. They, right? they were becoming entrepreneur. They became entrepreneur, and mm -hmm. they created. They set up a company, and they started doing, and sometimes doing very well. I yeah. see. Interesting. And like it. They like it very much. Uh, yeah, they enjoy, right? They enjoy because it right. it's a very difficult experience. Yeah, uh, if maybe if you're not made to be an entrepreneur, there's a lot of uh, bad situations, a lot of stress, and I think you 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 might have to be made of some kind of of skills to to get uh, along with it. Well, the truth is that um, the truth is that it's very. How can I tell you? Um, you have a lot of you you when uh, when you set up a company. Mm -hmm. There are many problems, obviously. Okay, when you are set, uh, you are starting, you have many uh, many situations, many problems, many troubles. When you look for money, for example, and um, and uh, a lot of doors say no. A lot of people you touch knock on doors and they say no because uh, that's not very interesting or whatever. And then once you are running. You have much many other problems that, uh, for example, uh, you cannot get enough money to pay the people. Yeah. Uh, the supplier are, hung, are are very are mad because uh, you are not paying time. Or, uh, There's a lot of problems, but in business, I think you have always problems. Okay, even if you are an entrepreneur or even if you are working for. A company. Yeah, if you are a manager, and uh, always you you have to solution problems. Okay, so problems you always have. The thing is that when uh, when it's your own company, mm -hmm. you also have uh, other things that you enjoy. It's uh, like uh, you are very proud when you you pay the people and the families yeah. on the, your employees. Uh, are happy because they have uh, they, they have an employee and they can pay their uh, their houses and okay. send the, their kids to the university even they can get married okay so you have a lot of times when you are very happy to to be an entrepreneur okay and that's the difference I think when you are not um, when you are a manager working for other people. Because at the end it's not your company, okay? You perhaps you have other good things, you have yeah. perks like your car and things like that, 
but you're not creating you're not but creating you don't, something you're not yeah. hoping towards exactly towards so I, for me the most interesting thing was the the relationship you have with, with your employees mm -hmm. that uh, that if things go go well yes okay uh, they uh, they thank you and they they say that they can do things because they are working and they feel well they feel good but uh, when the things go bad uh, then the problems with uh, your employees is also <laughs> the main issue so, have so you had some bad experience with with employees uh, yes I have uh, obviously always when you you have problems when I remember one once at the beginning really beginning I was mm -hmm. a very very uh, uh, owner of a with a, a small percentage of a company, really a small percentage of a company. And, um, and the people managing the company, that it was people I knew from from earlier time, uh, they did very, very bad, very badly. They did very badly, it was really a problem. And, uh, with, with managing employees? In general, managing the company. Yeah, the, was, the overall company. It was, it, uh, we had at that time a crisis in Spain, Mm -hmm. Okay, it was around 93, 92, 93, and in Spain at that time we had a huge crisis. Yes. Okay? After the Olympics and, and after all the money uh, employed for the Olympics at the World Fair in yeah. Sevilla, uh, the rest of the country, the rest of the cities, the economy had, went, uh, went had a very tough economy. Okay, and uh, and at that time. When uh, I, I in '93 I was working for a kind of friend that mm -hmm. I knew from uh, my old school, and I had a very small percentage of the company, okay, company. with no really no management role at that time, okay. But um, situation in the company became very very bad, really bad. And the, the people managing the company that were at the same time owners with the majority of the, the shares mm -hmm. disappeared. They disappeared Suddenly and they, dis they didn't want to So I, I left, uh, I didn't know what happened. I was surprised. One day they disappeared and until today. Eh? Oh, they yeah, yeah, they, they never came back? No, no, they didn't come back. So um, the company had, uh, uh, I am, uh, at that time, I, 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 I did my best to know what happened because I didn't know that uh, these people disappeared and, uh, and the employee, we had 100 people. 100 people and 100 people and, and they didn't know what to, what to do. I didn't know what to do. So I uh, suddenly I became the, the, the big manager, the top manager in the company. Without knowing what was going on. <laughs> and, and then I tried to, to, to do my best to... Uh, to solve the problem, mm -hmm. but the situation was crazy because there was no money, there was no money at all, and money has disappeared, and uh, with the suppliers, the suppliers we had, we we had to pay the supplier, but we, we they have there was no money, money to pay, was no money. To pay the and with the clients, we had the clients, some clients still owning uh, uh, money to us, but. Uh, they didn't want to pay because the situation in the company was so well, bad. So bad. They knew it, and they said, "Oh no, no!" Because we had an agreement with the managers of this, and uh, and then we we don't have to pay because you, uh, that agreement is is still valid. And they, okay, give me a copy of the agreement. There is no copy. It was crazy. So they didn't want to pay. So at the end, the only thing I could do was to. Um, Try to put all the people directly to the well, the, uh, the national organization mm -hmm. when the situations with employees goes very yeah. bad. I don't remember the name. Uh, in order for them to receive uh, money Com from the state, okay, yeah, compensation uh, from compensation. The and, okay, so uh, but the situation was really. I was really. I when I think about that moment, I'm really stressed. A few years later, mm -hmm. uh, well, that time was very hard for me because uh, people were very angry. Angry at uh, you and you, yeah, you yeah, weren't they, even they were responsible. Mad, they wanted to, to beat me, 
with the people and uh, all the people together in, uh, and say, okay, we want our money, money. what happened with that? I, I'm trying to, to, yeah, to, to solve this. Yeah, but we are going to, to beat you and things like that. It was, oh it was a, a real tough situation. But at the end, I did went you, to the tribunals and did you tried manage to, to... I managed to, to do that. But a few years later, yes. I was in Mexico. And I set up a company mm. in Mexico. I signed a contract with a telecommunication company, the biggest communication company there at that time. And it was the first contract signed privately by a company to distribute uh, telephone cards for calling calling cards. Okay. Mm -hmm. The phone. Yeah, from, for the for the cell phones. Well, no, no, not for the for cell phone. It was for long distance. They call. Because at, the, at that moment in Mexico, the situation was uh, it was state-owned the the the, the main telecommunication company, yeah. and then that telecommunication public. company was sold to a private company, and that private company owned the whole market. But uh, there was a um, law opening the the market. Okay, so other companies, American companies. Uh, corporation came to Mexico, and one of that uh, American corporation, mm -hmm. I got a contract to sell long distance. It means uh, you could using cards you with a uh, number, you could call from any telephone to long distance in the country to other states mm -hmm. in, in Mexico. Okay. Well, so I set up a company, and I already had uh, I had a partner in, in Mexico. Mm -hmm. It was a Spanish one living in Mexico. And I went I went to visit them before opening. Okay? At the end we couldn't open the company because uh, uh, really operate not open because we open but not operate because uh, there was a problem in in uh, well, there was a problem with the the big telecommunication company, Mexican telecommunication company. And uh, we had to wait, and then uh, we couldn't operate at the end. Yeah, but, in the end okay. but in that moment, we already had uh, hired like six, seven people, okay, at that moment. And then I went to Mexico to check and to wait for the opening. Mm -hmm. Because the opening was due to uh, one week more. So prepare everything for yeah, the get everything We had an office and, and everything. So I went to the office. And, and and my partner was presenting, introducing me all the people. Uh, this is this. Uh, the nice team. to meet you. Nice yeah. to meet you. All the employees. Yeah. And then one of the employees say, "I know you." Ah yes, from oh, I'm from Spain, and I know you. From where? <laughs> from where? I, I don't remember. I didn't, really don't remember your face. Yes, yeah, 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 but I remember yours. And uh, he told me, I remember you from this company. And then I said, oh, yeah, oh. no, no. <laughs> not again, no? No, no, no. no. It's, it's better not to have that memory. And it's better not to have people in a new company, in another country, with, with, knowing uh, all the problems we have in the, in the old one. And I said, I said, oh, sh sh really? Forget about that. Forget it. about that. And I told him, uh, please, sorry about what Everything happened? happened in Spain because it was a bad situation. I did my best and really sorry. And he told me, no, no, I'm very happy. You're happy yeah. with <laughs> the problems there. Oh, yeah, 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 I'm very happy. And all the people was happy. Really? I, 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 because I, after all the problems, yes, I tried to disappear for the world. <laughs> so. So I say, why you were happy? Because I don't understand after all the travels. And no, because you did. Uh, we re we recognize that you did your best and that you you went to mm -hmm. you you try to follow all the steps for us to get the money. Yeah. And we got all the money. Really? And I said, really? <laughs> because I didn't know. Yeah, yeah. We got all the money. So we are. We are really happy with you, no, no problem at all. So, so I can go to Spain, go back to Spain and speak to the people. Yes, yes you and can go. They no will problem. not, they will not the hate is me. Very, <laughs> is very happy with you because you are really? the only one trying to help us. Oh my God. And they, so they could have told uh, you don't before. want to beat me anymore. No, no, no. That's it. Okay.
<laughs> Perfect. So, uh, really, it was an experience that Absolutely. if sometimes if you treat the people well or try to do your best, yeah, you try to perhaps in other country, in other, <laughs> in other time, you will find this. Yeah, this it's, kind of it's good. People again, no? All right? So I see. It's absolutely fantastic how you were able to to um, uh, to reorganize that situation, and, and well, you tried your best, and and, and, you, and yeah, you got yeah. you got a, a good result, even though you didn't know <laughs> you didn't <laughs> no, know it, really. it happened. So, what would you say were your your skills, your personal skills that um, that made it possible to 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 get to this point? Is it problem solving? Uh, what what's the difference between those who who disappeared and you who stayed there? I Is that in, an entrepreneur? Well, I think every people has. Um, as I say, I think ninety percent of the people, mm -hmm. or almost ninety percent or eighty percent at least, if you use the rule of eighty twenty, yeah. can awesome. be entrepreneurs. Sure. Okay. Mm -hmm. And has the skills needed. To be entrepreneur, some of them has a kind of a skill. Some yeah. the other has different skills. It's like common in, sense, right? Maybe. In uh, sometimes it will be common sense that they think is the most important. Mm -hmm. um, but in my case, for example, I think the, that the, the uh, my skill, my main skill, is that I very how you say in English, uh, this alliance. Resilience, yeah. Resilience, okay. I used to start one thing, mm -hmm. if I really like and I really want, I can be there years, years, years. That's, I, don't, that's, I don't finish. Yeah. That's super important. It's very difficult that I give up. If I give up before, it's because I don't, th I, don't, I, don't I think th it's not worth, or I think I cannot do more. Or, Absolutely. Then, But in general, I uh, I stay stay working and stay persistent, researching, and persistent. Uh, yeah, really funny. really long long time. I All uh, I think most of the things I did in my life, good or bad, mm -hmm. or bad, I I spend a long time. When you usually people ask, okay, I w what do you think I should we should stay? To set up the company, do you think in one year we can, or in six months, or in two years maximum, we, we will be successful, or but not successful in money, perhaps, but, but stabilize, maybe, or yeah, break even, or start doing something? Uh, I said, okay, sometimes I made projects that it took me eight years. So to start, uh, to yeah. start. Yeah, I see. I see. That's probably so, the the main difference but between other people is different. Eh? Yeah, other people perhaps they go. I know people, very, very good people, very mm -hmm. good people. I have a good friend that is a, a very good entrepreneur and he is very fast. He needs to do and it he's, very he's changing. fast. So, so his main skill is that uh, speed. I, I cannot mm -hmm. be speedy. But <laughs> his people, is, he is very, is very fast. Try to faster, do it very uh, fast. Ch changing projects. It's starting like going, checking and starting, checking and starting and going. You know, he doesn't take the time. It's not so long time to uh, research or to prepare. Or to he has to be very fat and it's very, um, it's very successful. Mm -hmm. And other people, perhaps, it's uh, it's uh, do other things. It's uh, very good making um, making uh, customers. Yeah. Okay. So it's very good okay. uh, salesman. Mm -hmm. If you are very good selling, selling, so perhaps you are very successful entrepreneur. Has to do. Yeah. Or you can find. Uh, I have another friend that is very good. Is a good entrepreneur, and he is very good uh, buying. Mm -hmm. To say that he is, if he buys low, yes, uh, then you are successful because you can sell and always with, uh, a, with a margin. So it's true. So at the end, it depends on it depends on the person. So would you say an advice for entrepreneurs would be to maybe know your your personal skills, what you're good at, and maybe hire uh, those skills where you're where you're not good at. If you're good at research and, and marketing, but you you you've got no idea how to sell uh, a product, maybe partner or uh, hire that person that's good at of sales. Of course. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Um, that's. 
that's the theory and it's, it's the reality also. Mm -hmm. It's the theory, but it's the, the reality. But it's very difficult. Because it's very difficult to know what you are good at. Okay? It's really difficult. Because you, you think that you are very good to this thing, uh, to this subject or this mm -hmm. item, and then the rest of the people think that you are not very good to that, that you are good uh, yeah. in uh, doing other things. So um, it's complicated. What I, uh, but it's true that you, you should do that, okay, even if it's difficult. But what I think that you you have to do is that uh, when you have a project, okay, um, you should analyze in uh, in detail mm -hmm. the project, all the all the different parts, how you want to do it, what do you think, and the, the uh, to prepare a good business plan, even mm -hmm. uh, for yourself. Yes, I see. Not for investor, but for yourself. To have a, a business plan. This business plan means that uh, it doesn't mean that you have to prepare 40 pages, 50 pages for uh, uh, nice or whatever, but mm -hmm. all the main parts of a business you should know um, and, um, and, what and answer the, good, yeah. the, the right questions. The right for questions. example, who is your target, what are you selling, what are you doing, why the people is going to buy from you, how you are going to get your customer your potential customer, how do you get to them, and uh, if they are willing to buy from you, whatever. All kind of questions, if uh, has sense mm -hmm. in money, in, uh, you know, in, in financial, okay, that's uh, at what price you, you are thinking to, to yeah, sell. Different scenarios of... In general, the main, the main questions, okay? okay. Um, the size of the market, and, uh, the channel, the mm. co your competitors, a, com a referential competitor, the main competitor, to study, to analyze very well that competitor, I what see. they are doing, uh, what, how did it start, uh, the best things of this competitor, the bad thing, okay, all of that. I'll study research. Once you have all that information, all that yeah. research, you have to, um, to think what parts you can do for yourself, mm -hmm. saying, okay, from all the research, all the work I prepare, all this business plan, mm -hmm. I prepare a, a case study, or you can call it whatever you name it, whatever you want, uh, I think I can do this and this and this, for example, okay, I think the commercial or the marketing, I can do it, okay. uh, or the financial or whatever. and thinking that you have to go to the key points always mm. in your business the project you want to you want to set up you have key points key points meaning the core of the business the core of the business perhaps is okay I'm a digital business mm -hmm. and we have to develop a platform and connect a databases or make data mining or whatever so if that's your core business, obviously one of the main parts of this business, the key uh, profile, is very technological. Absolutely. Someone knowing very well uh, with uh, experience in, in databases or servers or whatever, mm -hmm. languages or I don't know, okay? So you have, to, you have to realize if you are able to take that part of the business. Mm -hmm. Say, okay, I'm very good. Uh, uh, I have the uh, knowledge to, um, to manage that area, technological area or not. Mm -hmm. If you think you are not, so you need, because it's, core, it's a core business, it's core of, of your business, you need someone to help you. you need and the that someone perhaps has to be a partner, because it's really core of the business. So. It's the same for the rest of the parts of the company. Mm -hmm. Perhaps you say, okay, it's, uh, it's key in this business, is key marketing. So I'm good in marketing or I able, I'm able to manage marketing. If you are able, perfect. Absolutely. Okay, but if you are not able, you need a, a partner. You need someone Because that is a core yeah. part of the business. So you have to analyze each part, take that 
core mm -hmm. areas and try to see if that area can be managed by you or not, or if you need partners taking care of that part. I okay, see. and the rest can be can be hired mm -hmm. or through suppliers or through employees or whatever, you know. Yeah, and try to. Complete. That's what I think in in general. Okay. Interesting, interesting. Okay, and in terms of in terms of the project that we were talking about, the business plan and the, the main the, the product, what what would your advice be in, in terms of what's more important, the idea or the execution of of um, of a project of a business or yeah, a project, business? Yeah. I think I really think that is the in general mm -hmm. is the execution execution yeah why because ideas really really innovative ideas are not so so many in the world yes okay uh, you see many when you through internet and you check and you you see very very good ideas mm -hmm. but in uh, comparing that new idea really new ideas so interesting idea comparing compared to the to the number of new businesses is they are very small so it's very difficult that you become with a new idea really original that, yeah that is going really to revolutionize the market okay. you have a lot because when you take in kickstarter or indigo or whatever of these places um, you find very very original ideas mm -hmm. okay really original ideas but what I say is that compared comparing to the rest of the business in the world setting uh, startups in the world okay they are really nothing absolutely nothing. okay because most of the business in the world really is in in um, in, uh, in Africa or in Asia mm -hmm. you have uh, the most of the startups in the world are in these places of the world and they are simple or simple business yeah okay to no. sell to buy to sell so execution for me is the most important because you can uh, you can work uh, uh, two people or five people with the same idea because sure in the world and even in your country other people are doing the same at the same time or are thinking the same mm -hmm. but one of those. I'm sure it's one of them is going to execute and uh, um, even execute better than the other, okay? Because it's very difficult. You always want to do things. So yeah. uh, I'm sure that the people listening to this uh, uh, to this uh, video is uh, is going know of friends or people saying, okay, that's a very interesting idea. Oh, I I, I want to do that. Oh, mm -hmm. I want to whatever, okay, to, yes, to do the same. Many people, when you talk about your idea to what you want to do to other people, most, uh, many, I don't know, most, depending on the idea, want to do the same. Say, okay, I want to do it. But the truth is that at the end, the sacrifice to set up a company is, very, is, uh, is what make a part, a person or another person, mm -hmm. the execution. Someone is really, uh, um, they, they want to continue yeah. with that thing and work and sacrifice time and family and, uh, and that's execution, okay? And um, other people prefer to put their time in other things, okay? So um, that's, I think, is the main point in execution yeah. more than idea. Yeah. Yeah, Even if you have a very good idea, obviously, yeah, but it's unique enough, in the world. It's, it's yeah, but even though if it's a unique idea in the world, you you must be very good at uh, executing this idea. Otherwise, uh, it's very difficult to. Yeah, you see all the time. Together, same, uh, yeah. same, uh, same company, same company in the same sectors, and company similar companies. One of them make uh, do better than others. Mm -hmm. It's because execution is better always. And setting, setting up a company the same. They have idea, a team has idea, try to Understand. develop and the other team. Same idea, try to develop. One of them execute better and the other uh, get uh, stop and 
and they, they, they don't get it on yeah, exactly. the way. Okay, interesting. And and you were talking about the the sacrifice of being of being entrepreneur. What's your experience? Um, it, it, does an entrepreneur sacrifice time with the family? Sacrifice other other projects? Maybe some some times of loneliness. Uh, what's your experience? Uh, yes, that's uh, all. Any entrepreneur listening to this is uh, is going to agree with me because yeah, that's not that's a uh, uh, sacrifice you have to do. It's uh, it's very big. Okay, you do the sacrifice because you like what you are doing, mm -hmm. okay, or because you don't have other possibilities. Other choice, yeah. Okay, you have you need the money for your family or whatever. But at the same time, trying to get that money, you lose the time with your family, for example. And I talk to, to to many people, and all of them say that. In, uh, in my, personally, I uh, I remember that uh, now I have much more time since a few years ago, and I prefer to spend more time with my family. Mm -hmm. And I have uh, I remember all my time with my younger kid. Okay, uh, but I, for example, I I don't I don't remember any time with my other kids. I don't remember. No. I think about that. They've been that working 24-7, right? I cannot remember because I was really uh, focused in, in the things I was doing. So it's, uh, uh, it's, it's, it's like that. And, uh, and uh, I talked to people. I remember one, uh, one person that is, uh, is the son of a very rich, uh, very wealthy mm -hmm wealthy individual in uh, in UK and he told me he, he's working with his father and um, uh, he's doing very well and he's happy with the family and doing very well with uh, with his father but he told me that uh, he, he, uh, he didn't remember time with his father really when he was, when time he was young, when right? he was young because the, the father that is one of the wealthiest in the world mm -hmm. is uh, has always doing something and um, not, not staying uh, staying with the family, so absolutely. like that. So uh, you have to decide. Uh, but at the end, sometimes um, try to balance both family, uh, family, friends, and and mm -hmm. work. But it's very difficult. But would, but you, say, you, know, would you say it's possible? People, yeah, I think. Yeah, I think that you can. Uh, but you can do it. I think you can do it if you get a, a position already. Mm -hmm. Okay, you are you have already money. You don't have. You are not struggling to set uh, to uh, to yes. start the company. Uh, you already the company. And the company already, needs uh, needs you 100%. You always have problem, even with the company's growing and always. And the the bigger the company, the bigger the problems. As Absolutely. Usual. But uh, but in any case. If you this, if you are in a, already in a position that the company is growing, is is, is stable, and um, and uh, with changing market problems, but you already have your in your bank, mm -hmm. you have savings, and you're already in a more uh, better position than when you start. When you start. And if you decide that uh, you want to to spend more time with your family or change focus. I think you can do it, and I know people who who, who did it, but uh, but other people no. The people they say, okay, now I am here. I want to be in a in a more higher position, so I'm make gonna much more money, more time. and then you have to invest more time to to put more time in that, and your family is suffering. So at the end, uh, but I I think. I, well, I, I can tell you sure that if you uh, you get uh, a balance right between you can get the balance if you want in some moment okay, okay. I'm sure okay and in, in, in your opinion well what what were your objectives when you were uh, when you became an entrepreneur when you started your first projects and uh, and you started in this startup world was it more more economic focused or, or was it more um, challenging of an objective you want to create something? In my, in my myself, it was always challenging. Mm -hmm. Challenge, always, always. Only okay, economic was only once at the beginning, the first when, one, I see. because I didn't have I, I didn't have money, mm -hmm. 
and um, I was in a very bad. After the the problem I told you, in, so uh, was it when you when you got yeah to when I first told problem? you the, the, yeah that they put a small uh, percentage. I had I got a small percentage in the company, mm -hmm. and the, the manager disappeared. Okay, at that moment, I um, I uh, when I left that uh, that company, mm -hmm. okay, when that company was uh, dissolved and finished, it was in bankruptcy. Bankruptcy, yeah. so. At that moment, my situation, my economical situation, it was terrible. It was terrible, absolutely terrible, because I, uh, I had to. I was looking for jobs, yes. and I remember I had no money for. I have to decide. Really, I have to decide to have a drink, have a coffee, uh, for breakfast, or 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 go to the or pay the tube because I don't have money for both, for, both. for the underground and for the coffee. At that situation, I arrived, yeah? and I spent most of my, all all of my money I have at that time. In how old were you? Out, how old were you? Out of curiosity, I should have been like uh, 30, 30 something, thirty two or thirty three at that moment. Yeah. Must have been very difficult that kind of situation. Yeah, I became I just married and uh, yeah with. Uh, uh, no, I, I, no, I didn't have a kid coming at that moment, just at the moment. Uh, but I was just married, and uh, I, all the money I had spent in, in trying to solve this problem before it was not possible to solve it. And, and in that moment, when I started working for, for myself, it was mm -hmm. because I had no other possibility. You had uh, and you I had needed to money. So I tried to, to find a job. I work for different people who pay me for different works, uh, jobs, and uh, I, I travel. They send me uh, looking for potential uh, partners in Mexico. I, I, I was I spent some time in Mexico, and then I went to China mm -hmm. and looking for other things and, and and trying to get a salary. Okay, uh, but it was. Even the salary was complicated. So, so at that moment, I was looking for um, uh, something for myself to mm -hmm. sell or to do, but uh, something that the people uh, were willing to to, pay to, to receive the information. Okay. So okay. I thought, okay, if I go to a company and I knock the door and and um, and then they say what do you want to do? what do you want i was willing to be to i was willing to say okay i sell this or mm -hmm. i do this and then they received me I, yeah, my I only my only desire wish was the that company receiving me i have the possibility to explain get, what to explain, i was doing get to talk with them. so i was looking for something to do mm -hmm. And at that moment, really, at that moment, uh, my only my my focus was money, but I needed money and fast. fast because your money. situation at that moment. Because the situation was very bad. I had to pay and I had no money. But um, after that, mm -hmm. years later, when I started the other things, uh, my only wish was a challenge. I I, I like it. Mm -hmm. Something, and I wanted to yeah. to see that done. I don't know how to say. It. Yeah, to to, 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 yeah, to, to get it. successful. I wanted to do it. And, yeah. Interesting, so. interesting. And what? And in your first project after after that bad experience, uh, what what did you what did you started as a as a startup? What was it, your project? Yes, it was. Um, I was looking, as I said, I was looking for something to do mm -hmm. fast and uh, something that different and a friend of mine living in the United States at mm -hmm. that moment a Spanish one living there he told me about internet and uh, we are talking internet. in 1994 or something like that okay mm -hmm. it was just uh, 93 it was just rea really the beginning the beginning of internet, because, yeah. uh, the browser was invented in uh, 92 Okay. And so no one, no one was using internet at the moment. No, no, no. I, my, f uh, he explained to me what was internet was. He told me this is going to be uh, very important, and 
and so right. so and he sent me uh, uh, reviews uh, magazines yeah. to read about the internet and uh, he, because in Spain there were no, no nothing and he sent me things that uh, that he bought for me in the United States and sent me mm -hmm. uh, and they they I started reading and I like it very much the idea and uh, and then I tried to connect a friend of mine um, gave me for free he gave me as a gift a small computer a small MacBook Pro that he had uh, spare in his home in 1994 or in the, in, yes around 93 94 93, MacBook 94. Pro in those yeah. years must have been it yeah, was, yeah yeah it was very, it was a great yeah, yeah it was 94 perhaps almost, mm -hmm. yeah and at the same time I, I was working for other people and taking some salaries in different scenes I told you mm -hmm. but I started reading and doing things at the same time and uh, and then um, I like it very much the idea and and set up a shop, a digital shop, uh, an e-commerce. Yeah, an e-commerce. And uh, I look for someone to program, mm -hmm. because, uh, and uh, I pay uh, a young guy. I said, okay, I want this and this, and he program. And um, I took pictures of different products, and we put together. We created a shop. It must have been one of the, the first shops. Yeah, in, in 90, it was open at the, in 94 or something like that. And I remember it was the, Amazing. the very beginning, the very first shops, because I received a call mm -hmm. at home from um, UPS, the transportation company. Yeah. They called from Brussels, from mm -hmm. Brussels, from Belgium. And, and they tell me, okay, is you this, Javier Calvo? Yes, yeah, yes. Okay, no, uh, we call from Belgium because uh, you are using a tracking system, our tracking system in your mm -hmm. website. For, for your orders website. or? A tracking system yeah, just for following the, the, the packages. Yeah, okay? for, the, for the packages. And he told me, you are the only one in Spain using the tracking system. So this yeah, is why we call because it was very strange. And so. And was uh, it working all right here in Spain? Hmm? Was it working all right in Spain? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It the tracking yeah. system? Yeah, yeah. But I never use. I, I never use. But they could put in the. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They, I, I put in, the, the, in the, the shop, but uh, they knew that uh, they have a link, and mm -hmm. they knew perfectly because I link it, the tracking system, uh, the servers for the I tracking see. system for were in Belgium, so they knew that someone in Spain was uh, was using this, and and then uh, they invited me to to a big project called E Christmas mm -hmm. uh, in 95 I think and it was uh, between Hewlett Packard, Microsoft and UPS and in nine uh, European countries. Oh. So the idea was to sell different shops in different countries, mm -hmm. uh, link it to the uh, same servers okay. and using UPS to to transport the for the logistics right? for the logistic and um, and it was the only com the only shop in Spain the only one <laughs> and we did nothing I think I, I, uh, I, in e Christmas we did nothing because nobody used internet at that moment yeah but, uh, that's the thing right you had you had the store online and but nobody uh, nobody knew that it was a store yeah but. Out, uh, outside of Spain, yes, I sold things, many <laughs> things, ah, many things, but I sold things in in uh, Nordic countries, Sweden, Norway, and Finland, for example, in the States. And you uh, sold it directly from yeah, Spain? Yeah, yeah, I, sold, I sold, for example, CDs, a lot of CDs from uh, uh, Flamenco. Mm -hmm. I sold, sold directly. I sold jamón. Really? <laughs> Yes. So you were the first one? And in the in States, uh, they asked me for uh, Cuban cigars. Really? Yeah, but the problem I had, I, I never, I, they, they asked me a lot for Cuban cigars, but they couldn't because it was, uh, it was uh, not allowed to sell yeah. in the States. I didn't, I didn't have no problems with, no. <laughs> with the authorities there. But, um, so I was doing this, mm -hmm. okay, only to learn, because at the same time I, I was doing other things. 
And I did many things because to get I tried to get some experience playing with the room. shop and the experience, getting experience. I made a lot of things. Uh, I, I made sometimes I received uh, one day I, I was trying to to push people to the shop and I say I, I was I get uh, emails from different mm -hmm. databases. At that time, it was easier to get from databases the university. Yeah, the databases. Uh, and then I received. Uh, I was doing spam. Really. <laughs> And I receive. Uh, yeah, but no one knew what spam no, no, was no, at was the no, moment. You, so you didn't right. use the, the word spam, but uh, you receive a lot of uh, people angry mm -hmm. saying, you know, that you cannot do that. Don't send me and, emails. And, right? and I, I remember sending emails saying, sorry, 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 all the time, like hundreds of sorries, and and it was. But they learned a lot how to put in the, how to put in um, higher in the. In, uh, in at that time Yahoo in or, SEO right yeah in the browsers at that time because it was different than now it was uh, well the rules were completely different yeah completely different yeah completely different nothing to but because I was doing this suddenly one day mm -hmm. uh, someone uh, well I decided that it was time to try to sell because in Spain uh, Spain the whole country started to talk about internet. Mm -hmm. Okay, at that moment, more it was people the, uh, in '96 uh, talking about internet. So I decided to sell my my knowledge because I, I had been doing internet for yeah, already two or three years, and uh, and then uh, it was easier to connect to internet because mm -hmm. uh, before my my first connection to internet for, was in in a note in Paris. Not in Spain because it was not possible in there Spain. There was no, no, in no? Spain. and uh, and then well, you have notes in Madrid, you have notes in Barcelona, you have possibility to connect. It, it was growing, mm -hmm. so at that moment I started offering my knowledge to people as a consultant, mm -hmm. oh, and the people was interested, and they paid me quite well. No? So uh, I started working for example my first. My first client mm -hmm. was uh, uh, Iberia, oh. and Iberia, for example, had no no website, no I domain. See. I see. The domain was no was inexistent. Mm -hmm. Iberia.com was, yeah, yeah, was yeah, inexistent. Yeah. And then I had uh, other big brands like uh, that time well, Continente, that is now Carrefour. Mm -hmm. I w I was working, um, but continuously with them for a, for the shop, the e-commerce, it, it was inexistent, they, they didn't have even people mm -hmm. to do that, so I started working with them to profile the people needed and start how to okay, sell through internet. So and the same with many others, uh, World Heritage Cities, and Sevilla, um, Valencia, Turis, um, mm -hmm many many companies and even many of the domains yes okay of the domains i bought myself and give it for free to them because i i was trying to explain to them that the domain was mm -hmm. the, the name was very important and they didn't understood and so yes. i i took myself the domain mm -hmm. and then when they realized that it was important then you i gave you, it to them for the for the same price I pay. So how interesting, how interesting. Yeah, yeah. So so uh, having Iberia having in mind from yeah. Iberia. really, yeah. <laughs> and now that that no, uh, domain Sevilla, Sevilla was mine. Really, and, yeah. Turismo Castilla, Turismo Comunidad Valenciana, Comunidad Valenciana. Yes, uh, was mine and. Turismo Those Castilla La Mancha was mine. Amazing. World Heritage City was mine. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Those domains today would yeah, be. Yeah, um, yeah. Millions. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's so expensive. Okay, and but it was mine during two, three, four years. Huh? Until they they realized yeah, it was yeah. actually something important yeah, yeah, yeah. internet, and, and they, they yeah. got inside. Okay, interesting. And and to remind everyone, you didn't have a technical background, right? You no. you, you didn't uh, no no, uh, no write no, no, no. websites or anything. You were no, just no 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 no. But but they realized that the internet was not about te uh, technology at that moment. It was uh -huh. more about uh, marketing, communications. Uh, I see. So I was not shy to, to try to learn 
the maximum of mm -hmm. the marketing, uh, wow. how to sell through another channel, for me it was that, yeah, absolutely, and absolutely. the technical part, it was not so complicated like today. Today I yeah. think it's more, you have to be a little bit much yeah. more uh, in, uh, immersed in, you know, in, uh, in this. And at that moment was, uh, you have to create a shop, for example, that I, um, With code. I knew what to and code, what kind of code you have to use, it was time and it was, at what moment was Perl, mm -hmm. uh, a language called Perl. And, uh, and then uh, I tried to find someone know about uh, Perl. And I realized I talked to someone working for Telefonica, mm -hmm. I remember it was, he was, oh no, he was studying and then worked for Telefonica. And I talked to him, I pay, he was a student and I, I used to tell him, you have to do this, this, because he didn't know anything about the internet. Nothing. Nothing. So I explained to them, to him, you have to do this, this, and this, and he wanted to learn. So at he, the same he, time. he would know how to do it, but but you no, were no, the one. No, no, he, he knew how to code. Yeah, but now. And I explained fine. to him what was internet was and how everything. Mm -hmm. So he was very inter very interested to learn too. So at the same time, I I paid him, but at the same time he was learning. Yes. And we finally had a how work in the shop. Oh. Hmm. From from what you're telling me, I can see that you've been a lot immersed into kind of networking or or finding the the right talents and and who to talk with from from the beginning. No, no, not really. No networking, yes, mm -hmm. because um, uh, yeah, yes, networking. I realized that I'm, uh, but because I had no other possibility yeah, yeah. to talk to the people or connect people and talk to people. We had no other possibility, so, you know, because I, it was my my character. Okay, but um, that yes, I'm very good to 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 try to get what I need mm -hmm. from people, uh, suggestion, advice, or meeting. Okay, that's uh, I think I very I'm very good because after many years I've yeah, been, been learning. Okay, and I'm not shy about that. I con I. If I have to contact the president of Coca-Cola, I contact the president of Coca-Cola, really, and I did. So I, I don't, I don't care. No, really, really, I don't care because uh, amazing. If you send an email, if he wants to answer, or you try, it's, you don't it's lose up anything. to him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, if he doesn't, he doesn't. You know, that, that's my idea. So I'm not shy doing this. Okay, and usually uh, um, outside of outside of Spain is very easier, it's much easier. Yeah, People right. used to answer, to replay, and if you ask in a, edu a educate, you know, so in, in, in educate a good manner, manner they used to to replay you directly or send your that email to someone to, mm -hmm. to replay to you. So things like that, I, I, I did many, many things, okay? I got it contacted many many people that usually you think that you are out of them okay mm -hmm. and it's easier than you think outside of Spain in Spain is more complicated and in Spain right yeah in Spain yeah. is much more complicated but that's one thing but looking for the right profile to hire and, mm -hmm. and the right talent for me that's more difficult it's more difficult right to get down yeah, for me I'm not very good to that mm -hmm. I made mistakes uh, I made mistakes doing this in my life. Interesting, interesting. So, and how were you able to close uh, Iberia, to close uh, uh, Sevilla, uh, such big deals? Were, were you were you that big at the moment? Uh, I don't I don't follow you. In 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 order, to, how how did you close those clients? I was such was, big was very easy clients. at that moment because uh, they you were you were the expert in in yeah, internet. They they yeah, wanted you right. They they were not many expert. An internet. Nobody knew about internet. I had. I don't tell you the company, or I don't tell you the the person, mm -hmm. because he's uh, he's a well-known name. But for example, one company mm -hmm. uh, and this person pay me to have uh, lunch with him. And to uh, to explain about internet, to answer his questions about internet, but 
question like uh, what is what is internet? What, is internet? what can you do? Generic. What is a what is a um, uh, a mail, an electronic mail? What is this? A question like this. And Amazing. I used to have once a month, for example, a, a lunch mm -hmm. in a very fancy restaurant, very good restaurant, pay for him, for the company, only to do to, to do that. And uh, and he was the general manager of a huge company, huge company. Eh? And uh, and the person who put me with him mm -hmm. to work was the chairman of the company. Really? The chairman of the company listened to me in a conference. There was a lot of people in the conference. He came to me and said, I'm the chairman of this company. Uh, it was very interesting what you say. And I, I would, would like, like you, you to pay. We pay you if you want for give uh, advice and suggestions to my people. How interesting. So yeah. at that moment, it was very easy. When uh, Iberia um, uh, 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 signed a contract with me for mm -hmm. helping, for suggesting, advising. As consultant. As right? consultant and internet. And it was the moment that nobody, there was no depart department, uh, internet department. There was no, no department. There was no, no one. I was the, the um, external outsider. Yeah. And I was the first person in the company to doing, start uh, in, in charge of that. Amazing. And then they put two people, I remember, mm -hmm. one people and then one people and one secretary to work in the department of internet, sailing, sales of ticket through internet. They put internet. One person that was almost, he was, uh, he, he was uh, not very young, and, uh, and one secretary, and that's, that's all, and, that and me. Nice. And that's all. And I that was the started. internet department of And my, my yeah. work yes. was to advise them and talk to them about internet. So it was very okay. easy at that time to work with big companies. Very easy. No, I imagine it was it was easy because because you had the knowledge and the expertise. Yeah, I had the knowledge and didn't Otherwise, know uh, yeah, yeah. And it was simple. You don't. Yeah. You didn't look for at that moment. You didn't look for special positioning or things like that. You, I remember I, I used to talk about positioning. And, and they, they would get lost. And then they were lost. <laughs> it was they like, okay, okay, let's start with work, mail. So if you start talking about positioning... I'm going to get super lost. Yeah. Amazing, amazing. And what would you advise uh, future entrepreneurs? Uh, you said that, that you were working on, on something different and at the same time you were reading and, and you were yeah. getting knowledge and, and starting your, your online store. Um, uh, is that would that be your advice? As in, uh, don't don't stop learning. Even even though you have a job or you're in a, in a market that is that has nothing to do with with online, for example, as as it was. Well, I'm not sure if it, if it was your case, but but uh, to 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 keep on learning and 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 touching different things. Well, uh, today I think nobody. Well, today I think. Nobody is going to say that it's not important to learn. Yeah, absolutely. Education is, is basic. Yeah. Education is much is becoming more and more important. Mm -hmm. And I think education is the, the, the segregation of people. Okay? Uh, before, segregation could be perhaps a wealth. Okay? Mm -hmm. uh, today, is, is, I think segregation is much more important than education because education became money or became a salary. Absolutely. If you are not educated, perhaps you don't get the salary even, okay? Or the better salary. Mm -hmm. So that way is very important education. So education is important, but at the same time, it's not only a question of education. It's a question of curiosity. 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 Exactly. If you That's are curious one. about one thing That's because you are passionate or whatever, Go so you are course. going to you have all the possibilities now to, to get that information. Before it was it was, it was that, impossible. that way. Well, it, was it was more okay. difficult. Now you go to Google. I remember what I, I all the things that I did in before was things that I didn't get through internet. There was no internet almost mm -hmm. at the beginning, so I tried to find information in internet. There was nothing. Sabes? So now, uh, if you want to learn something. It's very easy. So you have the videos, resources, documents. Online. If you want to know about competitors, you can potential research. competitors, you can get information about new ideas. Mm -hmm. You get information. So before someone 
talk about something mm -hmm. you were interested and you try to find something re uh, related to that so, but you have to go to bibliotheques uh, libraries or libraries and, uh, and ask other people who, who uh, might know about the topic uh, official official uh, organization mm -hmm. with uh, specialized with uh, documents or a business plan prepared by someone who yeah. was working in that country or in that area. So it was complicated to find information. Okay, You can find things, but it was difficult. But, it was, it but was now it's very easy. But as, at the end, what you need is your curiosity. Because curiosity and, and... Nothing more. Yeah. Curiosity and... Uh, I'm wanting to, and to willing. learn... The, the if you are willing to get willing. the information you need, you get it. Okay, fantastic. Great, great advice. Absolutely. And uh, in, in in your experience, what what have been your your success and your, and your failures? Your what's what has been your your major failure? And uh, did you learn? Did you learn from it? Uh, what did you learn? In general, after the successes I had and the failures I had, mm -hmm. I think the for me the the main the The main point for me was that, uh, or is that, um, you have to be very careful with uh, wishful thinking. What okay. you think? Sometimes you think that something is going to happen, or mm -hmm. something is going to be, or to go in the direction you think because you are willing. To that, that is going to be that direction, but the reality go in another direction. Okay, but you, you have, you are wishing. That yeah. something and you don't move then your you you are thinking no no that is going to happen that is going to and that's how it's going to be or that pe person is good or that and then the reality is another completely different completely different. so because you want you fail I had uh, I remember uh, one situation once that um, perhaps it's very graphic for you to understand the, mm -hmm. the thing is that uh, I I, I Uh, I, I was de developing a big project, a very big, huge project, that at the end was uh, was a success, but um, I had problems with one of the partners. Okay? Okay. One of my partners, I had problems with him, real, really strong problems. And, um, and it was someone that uh, I myself decided, wanted him And became okay. partner. Otherwise, it was me who decided. I think this person should be, because whatever can be moment, this because I was. So he was partner with a small, uh, a small share, mm -hmm. but he was partner, and he was uh, important in the key in the role that he he did. But it, we we had we were fighting really hard all the time. Okay. And really, I realized that I I, I had made a, a huge mistake, huge mistake. mistake, because he was not a very he was a bad person. In character, not only in he was a, a bad person in character, and uh, and he did whatever he wanted. And uh, if you have to go this way, he went to the other, only in order to to make things complicated, More complicated. and bad. You know, he was a, a very complicated character. And then I remember I was in a trip with uh, with another person of the company mm -hmm. traveling with me, and I was desperate. I was desperate. I didn't know what to do. And 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 even I didn't know why I was in that situation. Yes, yeah, because before incredible. before uh, being your partner, he looked like and, a, a good and, person. Uh, and then this other person, he's uh, very good. He's very very good to to spot talent and to spot profiles mm -hmm. that he is very good for that he told me uh, okay try to think now we are going to do he's a psychologist also and psychologist and he told me okay think the moment you sign um, the, the partnership okay mm -hmm. And I remember I told him, well, I remember that two or three days before that I have a big fight with him, really strong fight, 
and um, but a strong fight, okay? <laughs> I don't follow, but it was very strong. And then two or three days later, we signed as partnership with other people. And then he told me, no, 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 don't think about two or three days before. Think before. Think about the moment you signed. Okay. Say, I don't remember, it was like a few years ago, I don't really remember. No, no, try to think, concentrate and think. What happened when you sign? Remember you signing. Mm -hmm. Remember you take the, the pen and you sign. In that moment, what do you think? What do you thought? And I was trying to concentrate, really concentrate, and I said, okay, in the moment, I closed my eyes and said, the moment I was signing, I was thinking, this is nice. I shouldn't sign. I shouldn't sign. With all the people, you know, big investors and everything, yes. and I was thinking, I shouldn't sign. And he told me, you see, you were thinking that you shouldn't sign, and you, you sign. So, it's your fault. That's what it is. It's your fault. You cannot, now you cannot think that this, you already did it. And why you sign? Even if you, inner brain said, you shouldn't. Your inner brain, your and inner I said, no? because I thought that things were going to improve after signing. That like once <laughs> you sign, and the money is there, and everything is, everything is everybody is happy, yeah, and, and everything is good, and everybody is, uh, is a good person. But the yeah. reality is not. And he told In me, the you good see, moments. that's wishful thinking. You oh. were thinking something that is not true. And in your inner brain, you thought that it was not that. Mm -hmm. But you thought that things can be arranged and it's not true. So in that moment, you should have said, okay, I don't sign. I, don't I sign. cannot be with this person, no, no. You know? So the advice would be to, to follow your, your guts, your, your I think your inner you should Rather think, than think that, I, that I everything's going to no, change no, and I, it's going to be better? Sometimes I think you should follow your guts yeah, and think inside of you because sometimes your brain know more than, the than your head uh, No, really. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. the same when you marry or you are with a boyfriend or a girlfriend, yeah. it's the same. And you know you don't sometimes you say it's no but things are gonna are going gonna to improve. improve. Absolutely. As, no, it's not going to improve. If it's bad now, perhaps it's worse yeah. later. <laughs> it's going to be worse know? later. So you have to be very careful with that because it's wishful thinking. Absolutely, okay. That's yeah, a great and advice. When I talk to people here at the school and people preparing a business plan mm -hmm. and TFM and the project for the final master, many of them have wishful thinking when mm -hmm. they write down the, the financial plan, financial, the forecasting, they, know. they start wishful thinking, you know? why? Because that's very interesting, but you, the research say other thing, you know, yeah. why you, yeah, but, you but know. the market's going to go, <laughs> so, yeah. or whatever, no? Yeah. Interesting, interesting, that's a, that's a great piece of, uh, of advice. And so, so you learn from that for your next for your next experiences. I well, no, I, well, I I made mistake one and then and then. So the mistakes yeah. I think is continuing try to to um, to try to to, to develop right into yeah, it. Uh, you made a mistake yeah. and then you try to <laughs> to go and you step over, over the, the, the same over story the same. again, right? Yeah. I see, I see. Okay, and and would you tell us a bit about your 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 success? Your successes. Uh, uh, what was your best? Your best success. You have um, the biggest success I had. Perhaps is uh, um, well. I have two mm -hmm. um, complete different difference because one of them was more was complete success, mm -hmm. and the other was a complete success, but um, not so happy success for me. I see. The, the first one was um, a complete success because I, uh, when I was in internet, someone working, giving advice and mm -hmm. to companies. One company uh, decided, uh, told me to, well, I, it was my uh, suggestion to them mm -hmm. to prepare a website, specialize or focus, uh, focusing uh, small companies and medium companies, mm -hmm. okay, companies. 
uh, prepare a website, giving them tools to make um, websites, uh, pages, web pages, things like that. And uh, and it, we are talking at the beginning of internet, okay? And that company uh, thought it was a good idea because they have nothing related to internet in that moment, mm -hmm. and they needed um, uh, to prepare the website of the company. And and then when I told them that uh, it would it could be a good idea to have a website specialized with this. These different uh, websites for customers for they had okay. that they, they were an uh, important part of their business. Mm -hmm. They said, "Okay, uh, they I sign a contract, a big contract with them." Okay, and in a very short time, I I was me alone, and suddenly we were sixty people in your company. Yeah, in the company, 60. but in nothing because but that's internet time. Internet time. Yeah. That's the way at that moment. So <laughs> it was no strange, no strange. You could be in three or four months, 500 people like this. Yeah, yeah. In internet that time, in the state, in six yeah, months, you could go from zero crazy. to 1,000 or more. So it was oh like that. Yeah? Oh my god. Yeah, and then um, when I had already 60 people, suddenly the company said it was a big uh, telecommunication company mm -hmm. in Spain. And they decided that uh, the policy, the policy change, its policy change. So they say, okay, uh, now we want all the external businesses mm -hmm. has to be part of our uh, company, not supplier, external supplier. But now we want to control all the all everything done. Have it in the house. Company. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Instead of having suppliers, we have to 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 do it for ourselves. Mm -hmm. And then they come to me and they say, okay, now this company has to be, you have two possibilities. Or you sell to us, all the people, because we need all the structure and all the people, or you, we, we break the contract. Finish. There's no, no, possi no other alternative. So I say, okay, I sell to you. <laughs> there's, there's no more. Was and it was your me? only client? Or you yeah, yeah, it was my only client because uh, at that I moment, see. well, I ha I still had other like Iberia and yeah. everything, but it was very small compared to this to one. This that project is huge. was huge. 60 people, or more than 60, Just working for this, for this customer, for this telecommunication company. Mm -hmm. So they say, okay, we give you this money, and, and I said, okay, perfect, great. And uh, I knew, I knew uh, that situation, uh, internet at the moment was bursting, the bubble, mm -hmm. you know, it was yeah, 2000, 2001, 2000, 2000. Yeah, uh, the bubble was exploded, exploded in the States and then came to, to Spain in 2001, in March. Yeah. It was the big, in Spain, all the, yeah, the, 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 the Ibex came down and all the crisis, but in the state was in 2000 around November, October, well, like that, no, March, April, already. And I just came from New York. I just mm -hmm. came from New York from a trade fair, internet trade fair. You have in the state, you had four at that moment, the same fair in four different times of the year. It was huge internet in that moment. Yes. And, uh, and the fair in uh, New York was a, um, a fail. It was terrible. There was nobody there. And uh, when you had been you had been in the same fair one year before, yeah. and it was million people going, and then suddenly no one. And the next year, you say something is happening. Something and is when these people just arriving two weeks later, the company say, "We buy you." I said, "Okay, perfect." You take all the people, and it was very very fast. So so was and this for me? That was a huge success for me. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Was this before the crash? Just before the Just crash. before, so it was, Just it was perfect, crash. right? No, no, it was the perfect, perfect time. <laughs> perfect time. It was <laughs> so um, it was a big, a big success. Mm -hmm. Okay, it was not the big, the biggest sale, so you know, sale yeah. of the century because it was not like that for me. But it was a very good success because that allowed me to relax after ten years or eight of. years of. Crazy, oh, really crazy and problems and really, really bad time. So I spent, I decided to spend one or two years 
doing nothing. Doing nothing and traveling nothing. maybe and just uh, reading. Reading. Only reading. Only reading. And, um, and then when I set up another company after that, it was a theme park. Mm -hmm. Okay? Someone talked to me about an idea that he has, he had seen in in other country and he thought uh, for kids and he thought it was a good idea. So I tried to get more information about that. There was no information in internet at mm -hmm. that moment about um, almost nothing. And um, and I, I couldn't get anything about this place, a similar place more or less. Mm -hmm. But with the with the, this person, this friend, uh, was telling me how it how it was the place, how the kids play, role playing. Yeah, they yeah. play to become uh, uh, architect or to become fireman or you know they, mm -hmm. they role play. Yeah, and he he explained to me how it work it, and I try with that I try to develop an idea. And I started thinking, mm -hmm. because I thought it, it was a very good idea to develop that in Spain. Because it was linked to um, uh, malls, mm -hmm. commercial yeah, malls. Yeah. And at that moment I was thinking, I was in that moment already thinking to do something mm -hmm. related to malls, because they, they were growing in Spain malls. Mm -hmm. yeah. In all the country there were malls everywhere. So I wanted to do something related to that market that was growing, and suddenly this guy gave me this this idea, and I tried to develop something, and I started talking to people and trying to do. And after many years, finally, we opened the we, yeah. the theme park. It was a huge success. It was a, a huge success, and 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 it was a success. But for me, it was. Not very happy because I had after the the opening, mm -hmm. um, the investors they, they had two big investors and um, and between them there were a fight and I was in the middle because I was the CEO and and I have a, I was the founder but at the same time I was in the well, in the in the board mm -hmm. and they were fighting and I was in the middle and it was very complicated and at the end. One of the investors sold his part to the other, to the other investor. To the other investor, so the other investor became the biggest one. We we have in the board, um, we have a, a balance of three parts. Mm -hmm. But when one of the investors sold to the other, what happened with the other became the biggest one. So he is he, so he had me, more. I want to be alone because I want this business for me. The and other investor, in, yeah, yeah, because it has the majority of, of the stock, and we started fighting and having problems with these these people that they wanted the business for for um, uh, to use mm -hmm. inside uh, their group uh, to make uh, obvi obviously different. Um, uh, partnerships with, with the other, yeah, with other uh, uh, companies mm -hmm. of themselves or the same company and collaborate. I, 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 I didn't agree with that because it was good for them but not for the not for, for me the, or for the other small not for the project. The small people and uh, the small partners so and not good for the project at the end. And um, he wanted to have all for them and uh, and then we started to fight and it was very 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 dirty mm -hmm. and at the end I had no other possibility than to, to, to make an arrangement arrangement and sell my part I didn't yeah. want because I like it really really yeah. like it to be there. you enjoyed the to, I the enjoy it really a lot but I had no other possibility so that's why I say it was a success because the business was a success but uh, huge success it was but not for good. me was uh, was mm -hmm. uh, was not so it was not the best not, the best not outcome. Others, others. I see, I see, I see, I see. Well it's it's been very interesting and I would I would like to ask you the, the last question which would okay. be uh, the, the interesting I mean the generic. Uh, would you recommend people to to go for projects for entrepreneurship, to start the to, to go for their, their dreams and uh, in, in, in inside entrepreneurship or rather stay in, in the right. in the safe side? 
Well, as you can say, because uh, we've seen the uh, uh, kinds of problems that you can face in, you agree, in I, I think that that I, I really think that that um, question mm -hmm. is very um, uh, is very good question when you say it in uh, in the United States, for example, yeah, or in culture, even in UK or in Israel or country where uh, became an entrepreneur and. Doing startups are well considered by society, and, and and all the society help the entrepreneurs in one way or another. Uh, tribunals and justice help them and recognize that they are uh, they are they're risking they they're sacrificing much more than tribunals than and justice recognize the sacrifice, the risks, and they have to be paid for that. But. It's not the case in Spain. It's not the case in Spain. No, it's all the contrary. All the contrary. Absolutely. Here, tribunal doesn't recognize the uh, it, uh, the justice. You cannot say, okay, yes, no. I'm the entrepreneur, and I bring the, I brought the, the idea, and I brought everything, I brought the people, and I met the people, and so 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 I have rights mm -hmm. because of that, because this exists because of because someone. Of Push this of my time, of my everything. sacrifices, and, and the tribunal say no, no. We only accept uh, your share. I say yeah, but my share. You will see that my share is this because I needed money, and someone mm -hmm. came and put the money, and yeah, yeah. But you are, you have no enough money. You are no majority, for example. Eh? I'm talking about majority. So it's very difficult to make to be entrepreneur in Spain. Mm -hmm. It's very difficult and very sad. Okay? Yeah. And if you talk to entrepreneurs here, all of them are going to tell you this. Okay, it's very hard. Right. But you have very good entrepreneurs and people who make a lot of money. So and really it's compensated. At, and compensated. At the end. So to the people, what to do? Um, if they have the possibility, mm -hmm. and they really are passionate, if they dream about that, and they wake in, in the morning, wake up and think about that and, and, and they talk to their friends about that and the friends say, okay, shut up because we are, you are talking about that all the time, I think you should, you like, should go for it. You should try. You should try. And, uh, at least try, okay? Because otherwise you are going always thinking that you should I have. should have tried, I should have. Okay? And, uh, and you should, I think you should, even if it's all the sacrifice and everything, mm -hmm. you have very good things. So, I think you should. But, and, and even you should do it if you are in the position that mm -hmm. perhaps you don't have work because uh, your company closed or whatever, or you are fired or whatever, and then uh, you are thinking that this is the time for you to do what you wanted to do years ago. Yeah, okay? you really feel so you want to go. I think you should adopt. do it. You, you try also, okay? And go after this. Mm -hmm. um, but always thinking very cold with who you go in that thing, in that uh, uh, venture. Because sometimes people say, okay, we are fired for mm -hmm. the, from our old com former company and we are two or three people and who just... work it and they said, okay, we can put together our money, receive from the company, and mm -hmm. we do this. And that's not always <laughs> work. Usually it doesn't work, because uh, you the only uh, point in common with mm -hmm. these people is that you, you, work, at the you work with them a few years, and now you are fired. And you are good There's colleagues, no other, but no... And they have other interests, other whatever, and because in that moment they said, uh, but it happens a lot, you yeah. say, okay, we we are together and we do this. Oh, yes, mm -hmm. yes. And in that moment seems to be a good idea, but at the end it's, it's, it's not, not a good idea. Would it. that be your advice if you had to start again, eh, all over again, and, and if, if you went back to...? If I, no, I think I, if I had to uh, start over again, okay, I would like to have the same uh, success I had with the internet thing. Mm -hmm. The telecommunication that, company, yeah. I would like. But to start with the theme park, even if it was what I wanted to do, and I really 
was really willing to 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 create this company and to mm -hmm. create this this place, this fun place, and it was a success. I will never do it this the same never, way. Never, no, never, never. I, In I terms had of so, partners, so bad time, bad moments with this, you know, because of the people, bad people, bad people, really. Yes. It was a question of people only, bad people. Of joining or partnering with the, with the wrong jealousy, people. Jealousy, jealousy, bad people, really. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, fantastic. Okay. Well, thank you so much for your, for your advice, you. for your for your experience. It's been great. I'm sure that everyone's been learning learning a lot from this. And um, and well, thank you, thank you, everyone who's been joining us from from the other side of the of the camera. And we we hope you all enjoyed this this session. <laughs>